Here we are with Joey Decord for our first ever video goal year corner. This is a momentous occasion for the sound of hockey. We've never done this before live and in person with a goalie. So uh, this is thrilling stuff. So you're on our podcast very recently. Uh, the fans loved it. So, you know, you're, you're a friend of the pod forever now. Friend of the pod. I love that. Yeah, friend you, of the show. That's right. You have to come back now. Like you guys are going to have to fight. Uh, there's a, a sends podcast that I'm a friend of the show on and uh -huh. uh, you guys are going to have to fight them for, okay. uh, well, that's fine. For that's, who wants top fine. dog, we're, but I think we're going to win you over. Yeah, that's all I I'm going to say. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, all right. Let's start with the mask. Now we talked about the mask at length, uh, on the podcast. Yep. So first off, let's see here. I'll get the, I'll get the camera here. Let's see Sparky. He's there. Yeah, he's he in there. there. Yeah. He's, he's in there. So. All right. And then, That's uh, him. so this is the, uh, you know, your mythical Kraken. You got the red eyes, like the logo. Um, and then he's just kind of got his tentacles all over. And he's, it's kind of a big storm. And he's kind of crushing this ship here. Yeah. So that's that side. Yep. Okay. And then on top here, we got the S, um, also red eye. And this is kind of like the, the ocean or the lake is like frozen over and it's yep. kind of like stamped into the ice so yep. you can kind of see like it looks like there's water here inside of the frozen ice it's pretty sick um and then right here we just have like the seattle kraken like written lettering with uh it's got like the skyline like right here whoa okay just pick it up where you were yeah so then on on this side here uh mm -hmm. we got the seattle kraken like lettering and then yeah. in the in the lettering of kraken here you can kind of see the seattle skyline so right there is the space needle yeah um, see that? And just the whole skyline. It's got the red lines through it, just like the jersey. Yeah. Um, you know, one thing that doesn't really come through from afar is there's a lot of sparkle in there. I like the oh sparkle yeah, up close. Oh yeah, there's a lot of detail in here. Yeah. Shifty uh, does not mess around with his, uh, no, his he details, does, not. does he? And then on the front here, you got the anchor through mm -hmm. the 35. This 35 is actually in um, the Sun Devil Hockey font. Yeah. So it's a little bit different. 35 is kind a, of another Sun Devil A subtle Devil ode to your ASU roots, of Correct. course. Correct. Yep. yep. And then okay. uh, back plate is... Uh, my roots, where my family's from, Switzerland, Canada, and, and uh, I was born in the States. Yeah. A um, little Sun Devil um, pitchfork, and then this is uh, the House Stark sigil from Game of Thrones. It's me and my uh, best friend and my brother, the three of us are, uh, we're, we're House Stark because yeah. we're, we're family. Makes so. sense, makes sense. That's the bucket. All right, so we'll take a look at the gloves here. Just putting it on for real effect, which we appreciate. <laughs> Well, it's just, I can't hold the mic and right. two hands on the well, gloves. So yeah, I mean, I guess if you were doing the blocker in theory, <laughs> you could hold the hold the mic with the yeah. blocker hand. But uh, so yeah, pretty much uh, gloves. Pretty simple. I use a 590 break um, with a single T. I don't. I what don't does really the like, 590 break mean? There's like a 600, 590, 580. It has to do with the angle okay. of the way it closes. Okay. I don't particularly know the difference. Okay. I just know this is the one I like the most. Do you like the pocket to be really deep? Um, no, not overly. Okay. Um, but then I got skate lace in here, mm -hmm. and then we got all three blues. We got the navy blue. Uh, I believe this is icy the ice blue, blue yeah. and this is the shallow blue. Yeah. Okay. And then a little red. Mm -hmm. And a little red. Yeah. My oh yeah. Name on Dax, there. there you go. We'll grab the we'll grab the blocker. Same thing. It's three different blues. Little touch of red. Got my name on there. It's it's a waffle board. Yeah. They're all pretty much the same. Yeah. Yeah. They look <laughs> so great though. The they look so sharp and clean. All right, so we got the pads. Um, I like to use, it's called like weave. Yeah. So any color that gets offered, you can kind of see like there's almost like a pattern in the color. Yep, I see that. Um, yeah, you can kind of see it pretty good there. Mm -hmm. So um, I wanted to do, I wanted to get all three blues and then a touch of red, same as the gloves. So uh, we got all three blues here. Um, I like to have some fun with it. So that's kind of that. And then a uh, nice touch, touch of red. Back of my pad here, it's, uh, all blue. Yeah, and, and then, we talked uh, about the importance of Lefebvre on the podcast too, and how they've they yeah. stuck with you. Uh, yeah. Let's talk about this strapping system here. Now, I know a lot of guys have just gotten rid of the leather straps altogether. Uh, was that a choice, or, or do they automatically come with the leather straps? No, I got those put on. Okay, uh, those are those are not a stock option, I uh -huh. don't believe. Okay, um, and if I'm being honest, they literally don't do anything. They're just there to look cool. <laughs> Uh, you think they do look cool? These these three straps here. So I I wear this one like this. Okay. So these kind of these are the two calf straps that kind of lock in your calf. Yeah. This one locks in my knee, um, and then these kind of come across uh, and hold all this stuff in place. So is but, there any is there any level of like a mental like I just don't fully trust that the Velcro is going to work, so I want a leather no, strap. It's not at all. Just because you like the look of the leather strap. Purely because it's how it's how it looks. It has nothing <laughs> to do that. with the performance of the pad. I absolutely love that. I noticed yesterday. 
you were you were wearing the red and black pads still, yep. right? So today you had these guys on. Mm -hmm. Is this like the that's the very first wear that we saw today at yeah. practice? Yeah, yeah. Well, they and, came in yesterday. The, the gloves got here. Um, those aren't the gloves I've worn. Those are the other set. You get two sets of gloves. Mm -hmm. So I haven't worn those. Um, the gloves came in on Wednesday, so I was able to wear the gloves yesterday for practice. Yep. But the these ones came in uh, after practice yesterday, so I wasn't able to wear those. But so uh, you did the uh, the photo shoot the other day. Uh, it looked like you were wearing these pads. Am I right or no? No, I was not. I was not wearing these. But you weren't uh, wearing red and black. Drewby was gracious enough to uh, <laughs> to let me throw his on for the for the photo shoot. <laughs> That's and, uh, incredible. I love day. it. So I, I absolutely did love have it. my own gloves and everything else was my own, but. He let me throw his pillows yeah. on, which was I, very nice. Of him. I think it would have taken a very keen goalie gear eye to notice that. So yeah, it was, a lot yeah. of people couldn't tell. Yeah, so. exactly. All right, well, Joey Decord, thank you so much for doing this. Uh, best friend of the pod, and forget about that <laughs> Ottawa one. Uh, we're thrilled to All have right, you. All right, we'll move here, on. So. Yep, I'm good. We're good. Cheers.